Hey everybody and welcome to Leia's Lair. Here are five easter eggs you may have missed from The Mandalorian Season 3 Episode 7. We hope you enjoy. Number 1. Commandant Brendel Hux. The name Hux sure sounded familiar and for good reason. The Hux we see in The Mandalorian, a member of the Imperial Shadow Council, is General Hux's father. He's also played by Brian Gleason, brother of Domhnall Gleason, who played General Armitage Hux. Number 2. Project Necromancer We learn the Empire is working on Project Necromancer, clearly referring to the cloning plot we've seen in all the seasons of the show. Appropriately named Necromancer, a necromancer is someone who resurrects or brings people back from the dead, this project is likely codenamed for the experiments conducted by the Empire to bring back Palpatine, which we see in the sequel trilogy. Number 3. Praetorian Guards if you watched The Last Jedi, you probably recognized the red armor guards at the end of the episode taking on Paz Vizsla. These guards, who are skilled in melee combat, and are descendants of the Emperor's royal guards in Return of the Jedi. They are seen in Episode 8 taking on Rey and Kylo Ren after they defeat Snoke. Number 4 Death Watch This episode confirms that the Children of the Watch, the Mandalorian extremist group from Concordia that Mando belongs to, descended from Death Watch, the terrorist group that opposed bo pacifist sister, Duchess Satine Kreese, during the Clone Wars. bo was once a part of Death Watch 2, during the civil war that broke out on Mandalore's surface. However, when Maul manipulated the Watch and killed Satine, bo left Death Watch. Number 5. Grand Admiral Thrawn and Captain Pelion Captain Pelion makes his live-action debut during the meeting of the Shadow Council. Introduced in the classic 1991 Star Wars novel, Pelion is Grand Admiral Thrawn's right-hand man for much of the original Thrawn trilogy. Now in the live-action world, Pelion appears to continue his devotion to Grand Admiral Thrawn, imposing on the Shadow Council the vital secrecy that he believes should surround Thrawn's return. And there you have it! Thanks for watching everyone! What did you think of this video? What other videos would you like to see? Let us know down below in the comment section. And remember to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more great videos to come. We hope to see you all again in Leia's Lair. You are not a Jedi yet.